Hello, OPS family. It is time already to do an April month in review and a May look ahead. April flew by, it started with spring break. Hope y'all had a great spring break. Seems like such a long time ago now, uh, but hopefully everybody has come back because the month just flew by with lots of energy everywhere in our district. Uh, we'll start with the Isaac Sterrett Community Cleanup Day. Uh, that appears to, to become an annual event here in our community. We thank the sponsors of that event. Uh, OPS had its own internal challenge of $500 to the service organization that collected the most trash that day. So congratulations to the Faust community and the Faust Rocket leaders who have won that $500 from OPS. Also thanks to the Faust Rocket leaders for hosting our April Ward Luncheon we had a great time hearing from them. They gave a great presentation to our board. So thank you to the Faust community and the Faust Rocket leaders. OPS has a new website. Have you seen it? Please go visit our new website. It is hopefully easier to access information. We continue to update those both on the school and district levels and we will continue to do so. Stay tuned for hearing about an app that you can download and see that website uh, on your phones. So stay tuned for that information. We held a district English learner night at Faust recently, and uh, thankfully 250 of our English learner families came to Faust to help get ready for anywhere they would go next year and get signed up and paperwork completed. So thank you to the sponsors of that event. Uh, it was very successful thanks to our community partners who also came and helped during that event. Uh, we had over 150 students get registered for next year. Speaking of getting registered for next year, have you online registered yet? If you haven't, it's required. Everybody needs to do online registration. So go to startolr.com and get registered. Newton Parish held their Ag Day. That's an annual event for Newton Parish. It was a great day and lots of community partners once again uh, descended on Newton Parish and a great day was held by all for Ag Day. So thank you for that. Also, thanks again to our community. We had over 40 people uh, in our district recently giving us input on our strategic plan moving forward uh, into the next five years of our plan and a lot of career technical advisory groups giving advice on how we should proceed to help students get ready for that career technical world. So thank you to all our community partners for your input there. Cravens held their community open house. What a great day that was. Hundreds of people came to Cravens to see all of the renovations that have been completed. Uh, it looks beautiful, the campus is beautiful, and now the students are able to play on the playground, the new playground outside. They've been waiting for two years to do that, so uh, thanks to all involved in the Cravens project, and we're so proud of how it looks uh, at Cravens. The robotics team at OIA continued to do well uh, and ascended to the national competition. And when they got there, they got out of the first rounds of competition and joined up with Davis County High School's uh, robotics team. So they teamed up together, which was a nice community event for our entire community. So congratulations to the robotics teams. May is coming fast. And as we know, May will be the fastest month uh, with lots and lots of activities just chalked in there in the last few weeks of school. Testing is right on our doorstep. Please ensure that all the kids that are taking any kind of state test get a great start to the morning, uh, get to school and get a great breakfast or have a great breakfast at home and get their brains ready to show off all they've learned. Also, good luck to anybody taking an AP test, which is also coming up very soon. So we have all the end of the year activities coming, all kinds of activities at all of our schools to celebrate the end of a school year. And of course, culminating in our graduations that are uh, at the end of the month, May, in the May 20s. So um, please celebrate our class and our graduating class this year. We couldn't be more proud of you. And 
I believe that's a wrap for April and May. I will see you at the end of May to review the month, of, the busy month of May and looking ahead to our summer. Thank you, OPS family.